Hi, this is Vilna for Dear Lizzie's blog again. So I'm going to wrap gifts. So for um, I have two very good friends and the one friend, I love to cook Indian food and she always wants the recipes. So I decided to buy her all the spices and she gets a peri knife. And my other friend got a very special gift from Sephora and you can see I'm just re using the Sephora um, red paper and it's a Bobbi Brown um, eye, eyeshadows but don't tell them it's a surprise so I'm wrapping actual gifts that I'm going to be giving to my two best friends so I bought this beautiful um, rolls of paper from Michaels they have they look like birch trees and wood so it's absolutely lovely and they, uh, the little boxes is from the dollar store, as you can see, they're super cheap. So I'm just going to forward this very quickly because I'm not the world's best gift wrapper. As you probably can see here, I'm <laughs> a little useless with it. And honestly, gift wrapping is my least favorite part of Christmas. But I do it because of the end result. But this time around, it was actually a lot of fun. So I loved doing these gifts because it's almost like it's really uh, a little project so I'm using dear Lizzie's trim from her new collection serendipity which is a beautiful beautiful collection and I'm going to be adhering the trim to the top of the little gift so I'm opening just opening the packet and I'm using the pink um, velvet one so what I decided to do was just to add, adhere it with a little bit of hot glue and that way I know it won't go anywhere. So a little mishap there. And then just another dot of hot glue on that side as well. And now I'm just going to set it aside to let it cool off completely while I wrap the spices. And I'm using a different paper for that one. So I'm just going to... Um, I wish I can wrap this fast in real life. Wouldn't that be a, a treat? So there you go. And for this one, I'm also going to be using... Um, Dear Lizzie, um, I'm using the gold. And I'm going to be adding more um, embellishments to it. But... For a start, I just want the hot glue to cool off completely. So that's why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. And really, um, you know what? Scrapbooking products, and we have so much of it in our stashes, is makes the best wrapping gifts. You know, it, because just the embellishment, you can embellish it so pretty. So just wrapping this one with the gray paper. And I love photographing these projects that really photographed so beautifully. So again, I'm using a DLZ trim and I'm using the purple uh, ribbon for this one. And again, I'm just adding a little bit of hot glue. And I'm just going to cut off. I was hoping there was enough to maybe do the front part as well like a real gift but there wasn't so it's okay I'll just save that piece for later right and now I'm just going to play so I'm having I have organza um, ribbon and I'm in pink and I'm just going to fold it over a couple of times and just give it a knot And some string as well. I have uh, just the plain craft colored string. I'm just going to wrap that over a couple of times as well. So the friends that I'm giving these gifts to, they're not particularly very artistic. But let me tell you something. When you do a little, 
when you go through a little bit of trouble to really do um to embellish the gift they there's no one that appreciates it more um than especially people that appreciate art but are not necessarily very um creative so i i'm just very excited to do this for them and it's really a work of love so i'm using love the word love it's um foam letters by dear lizzie and how pretty is that from her new line serendipity and i'm just using a talk bag on the back of it to take away the stickiness and i'm using these bows also from her new line and they're almost like leather so it's lovely to work with and the ephemera pack has these beautiful um, flowers in it and i was a little sad to be using it on a gift but i decided to do it anyway so I'm just adhering the love uh, with a little bit of hot glue as well as the bow to make sure that nothing falls off. And uh, she's really going to have a hard time opening the gift, but that's her problem, not mine. So look at that. How pretty is that with um, that beautiful wrapping paper? I think it makes a big difference. So for this, um, the spices i'm going to uh, use this baker twine and just wrap it around a couple of times i bought it at michael's and it's and it's like a coarse type of string but it looks like baker's twine so it's really pretty and i think the red makes it pop and that that just makes it interesting so it does give off a little bit of fuzzies the red and white baker's twine so that's why i'm just cleaning my work table there a little bit and now i'm also going to be using um a sticker uh from dear lizzie from her lovely line serendipity and how pretty is this it's s simply beautiful again i'm using the talk talk bag just to take away the stickiness and i'm also going to be using a little deer that I got from Michaels as well as um, another word so I think I'm going to be using happy or no not best oh yeah the word best because the, she's one of my best friends so I think it worked lovely in that um, sense and just a little bit of hot glue just to adhere it to the middle. And that little deer makes it so interesting, don't you think? And how pretty is that? And now for the last one, I um, am going to, let's see what I'm going to do just going to use um, again the craft twine and just going to wrap it around a couple of times as you can see there and now I'm just going to give it a quick knot leave the edges and then use that little flower as well I'm going to be talking the back of it and then adding a piece of pink and I don't know if you can see but no you can't but I'm just using hot glue to adhere it and that would be too much so I'm just going to stick it down and cut it off and now for the little flowers and I'm going to use the black or navy colored bow which is beautiful and just stick it down with a little bit of hot glue and now, now I'm using some of her white um, words and it, it's cut from very it feels like a good good quality paper and there's lots of words in that little package but I'm just going to use the XOXO 
so I think that's going to be perfect just a drop of hot glue on the O and just going to stick it down and there you go and look at that literally in 10 minutes or so you can have gifts wrapped and not just wrapped but beautifully wrapped so I'm just going to show you um, the details and you can see more photos on the Lizzie's blog so if you like this project you will love my heartfelt Christmas workshop currently on iHeartStudio.ca we are do 12 of similar projects like this that just puts you in the mood and the spirit of Christmas so I hope you checked it out check it out okay this is Vilna and I'm saying goodbye